Hey guys, it's the Scorn. Ever wanted a simple way to get your DVDs onto your Mac? Now you can with a simple app called Rip It. Rip It basically takes your DVD and copies everything directly to your desktop or wherever you want to put it. I've put in Star Wars 4 here. It's going to take 7.6 gigabytes, and basically all you have to do is hit Rip It. And off it goes. Let's check out some of the settings. We can turn off the spinning uh, disc here, but I happen to like it, so I'm going to leave it on. And basically, you can choose where you want to put your movie when it's done. I normally use an external hard drive, but today I'm just going to use my desktop. You can have the DVD start ripping automatically when you put a DVD in. And that's about it. I'll be back when this is done ripping. Okay, so we're about a minute and a half away from being done. And there's two things I'd really like to say before I finish this video. Uh, one, please don't go out to like a red box or a movie rental place and use this application with it. That's highly illegal. And two, if you do use Ripit on DVDs that you own, do not put them on websites for other people to download. That's also highly illegal. Um, a few quick things while it's finishing up. They have announced a new version of Ripit that's going to put movies into a format that can be read in iTunes and iPod compatible formats. And also check out their website if you're interested in this. It's called ripitapp.com. You can download a free trial. I believe that lasts for 30 days. You can rip as many DVDs as you want in that time period. And then they just have a few fun facts here. Um, why would you even want to do this? You actually save some battery life watching a DVD on your hard drive as opposed to watching it on your DVD drive. You can easily organize things. You can find your movies really quick with Spotlight. Um, you can't scratch or break a movie on your hard drive and why carry around extra DVD cases and all that extra stuff when you can just have it on your computer or a flash drive. And it's, it's been a great app. I've used it for a long time. So we're just going to let this finish up and I'll show you the final result in a minute. Alright guys, here's the final product. Let's open it up. And here's the DVD. So you have the movie, you get the chapters, options, whole DVD is all here intact. Hope you like this video. I'll be back with more on our next video. See you next time.